What's up, Five Nights at Freddy's Phantomatronics? This is Five Nights at Freddy's Friday. I'm Toy Insanity, and this week I picked up the two Blacklight minifigure packs from GameStop. Now, these are the fifth and sixth minifigure packs overall, and they are just repaints of the first two. So there was the initial two packs in their standard colors. Then they did a nightmare pack and they did a sister location pack. So that would have been 16 figures. This now brings us to 24 figures in this little line. See this thing in the back that says blacklight? Why would they do that? I mean, it's kind of cool looking, but if they had done Five Nights at Freddy's on this, the logo in the blacklight, instead of the word blacklight, why would they do this? You could incorporate it as part of your display somehow. It would look really cool behind the Funko Pops, the articulated figures, these guys, or the plush figures. Man, I guess some people are still going to put this on their display. But man, why couldn't they have done the, the logo? Why Why would anyone want the word blacklight? Anyway, here's the eight. Freddy Fazbear. Black light responsive blue. Foxy. Well, this is weird. You get foxy pink and foxy green. So what was the... What was the eighth figure original to these packs? Did they do two Foxies back then? No, they did Springtrap. Oh, they still don't Springtrap. This is weird. I literally didn't even notice this until I started to open them. There's not two Foxies in the original two packs. This is cool. I like Golden Freddy in the black light responsive paint. It wasn't the puppet. It was... I don't know. I thought the coolest in the initial release was the animatronic skeleton. Which is back. Man. I know they did Balloon Boy... Was it two, two Foxies? No way. No way. No way. I gotta look this up. All right. Here's the eight. I've always thought that the Golden Freddy was in a little bit different scale, but honestly, the nicest of the eight figures and then you get your core team. Oh! Duh! Duh! What if what are they doing? Where's Bonnie? <laughs> oh my god, Funko, where is Bonnie? You guys were screaming at your computer while I was rambling. Like it's Bonnie! Twin Sanity, you're an idiot. Where it's Bonnie! Look at this stupidity. Foxy. Foxy. No Bonnie. No wonder these are shelf sitters. Every GameStop I go to, and this is obviously why I put these off several weeks after the initial release of the Blacklight Responsive figures. I did the Funko Pops. I did the Mystery Minis. I even did the plushies, and normally I don't even collect plush. You know what I mean? The mini plush, the Mystery Mini plush danglers, because I'm going to make a Five Nights at Freddy's Christmas tree. I even have the pins, although I'm not going to do a video for the pins. I'll throw them in a video with some other stuff. Probably could have thrown them in with this one if I knew where I put them. But, did the articulated figures. The whole point was like, will I ever get these? Probably yes. Today's the day. But I'm, I'm still scratching my head like, why has nobody else ever bought any of these? Every game seller I go to has full stock still. Probably because there's no Bonnie. 
Uncle, where's Bonnie?